If you want to use your brain power and also physical activity, it'll work perfectly well. It's good for your brains, it keeps your mind alert and it's highly energetic. It gives you enormous amount of energy, at the same time it keeps you very, very calm. miraculous things to the body. Sufficient consumption of fruit can do great things to the system. So if you go on a fru total fruit diet, stomach will feel empty within two hours time. So you must get used to hanging on with high energy but empty stomach. This is the time your brain works best. This is the time as a human being you function best, it'll be good for you. So if you want to use your brain power, and also physical activity, it'll work perfectly well. So especially in today's world, it's very important because we value a human being in the work areas, I'm saying. We value a human being for their brain power, not their brown power. So, for this, fruit will make a huge difference for sure. One more substance which could be very good for you in daily consumption is honey. Honey is the only substance found on the planet whose chemical composition is very close to that of human blood. You change a few things, it's almost like blood. Daily consumption of honey can do a lot for your health, especially people who have excess mucus problems. It's very good for your heart, it's good for your brains, it keeps your mind alert and it's highly energetic. So daily consumption of honey can do a lot, especially if you have growing children. They must consume honey on a daily basis. It'll do a lot for the development of their intelligence and everything, even the ash god. Ash god and honey together will make a wonderful diet for children in terms of enhancing their intellectual capabilities. Chocolate eaters have a lot of trouble because of the volume of sugar that they're taking in. If you could eat just chocolate, uh, it is a certain kind of stimulant, a very strange kind of stimulant. It has its uh, positive values. Um, actually, your brains could work, really. Your brains work a little better if you take in Cocoa, not with so much sugar. Sugar spoils the whole game. If you just take in cocoa, if you take in cocoa seeds and chew upon it, once you get the hang of it, it's nice. The chocolate cocoa seeds, if you chew on it, it's very, very good. Pepper, white pepper and the cocoa seeds have something very similar. In India, we use honey and black pepper in combination for variety of problems, variety of problems that people have and it produces miraculous results. Cocoa also has something similar without the sting in it. There is also hundred percent chocolate available, but maybe most of you won't like it because it'll be bitter. If you can take it without sugar, it's fine, or with minimum sugar, fine. If you consume a glass of Ashford juice every day, you will see clearly the sharpness of your intellect will enhance itself. Especially children must drink ash god juice. Daily consumption of ash god, you will see distinctly your mind seems to be clearer and sharper. This will be noticeable within a few weeks of consumption of ash god. You will see morning you drink coffee, it gives you energy with agitation. 
You drink a glass of ash god juice, it gives you enormous amount of energy. At the same time, it keeps you very, very calm. One should consume it as much as you can. But those of you who are asthmatic, who are susceptible to colds and coughs, such people, if you consume ash god juice, you may immediately have colds because it cools the system. So if such a problem is there, such people should always add a little bit of honey or pepper to ash god juice and consume it. This will neutralize the cooling effect of the ash god to some extent. Sprouted fenugreek or methi as it's known, these seeds are fantastic uh, blood cleansers, good source of protein and vitamins and minerals, very good for uh, lactating mothers, great for hair and nail growth, reduces blood pressure, brings down blood sugar level, lower inflammation. These uh, sprouted fenugreek or methi along with sprouted uh, green gram or mung is very, very good for cognitive health. Those who are over fifty years of age must consume this on a daily basis, <laughs> otherwise you may not realize slowly you will lose it.